Guys, I just got the call. Um, the samples from a second drill hole into the Moy Discovery have arrived. I'm excited, but yet I'm quite nervous. If we have Moy in that core, then the system is big and it's exciting and we're gonna drill more. But if there's none, then it might be too small and uneconomic or might be just a fluke and we have to shut the project down. So let's go there, let's rip that Band-Aid off and let's find out. Finding a new deposit is a really big deal. We used to be finding a decade ago 150 deposits across all commodities, but now this number has decreased to just 40 globally per year. Since we're moving to renewable future, we don't know in the long-term outlook whether we have enough metals. Every deposit is a very big deal. So we just got a new shipment of core in from the drillers. And so right now we're kind of processed it um, to get it ready to cut. And now we're gonna cut uh, and then sample it and send that off to the lab so we can get some results. Before we cut any of the drill core, we have to make sure that all the markings are right. We just go through and make sure that all the meterage matches up so that we know exactly where the hell we are before we cut into it. Look, look, at the, look at those white, you know, the man has been working. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> take a picture, take a video of that. <laughs> look, at the, look at these working knees. <laughs> what we get excited about is when we see mineralization near the top of the hole and it continues all the way down. That means that the system's continuing down the hole and can be even bigger than we initially thought. Wow, oh. shit. Jesus, look, look at that section. Oh. Holy, oh. Oh, how intense sight. is that? Wow, the alteration, like the density of alteration is massive, man. It's just, it's big. Look how shiny this stuff is. I don't know what that is. Is that hematite? Like, why is this, is it, or is this cobalt minerals? I don't know. Like, why is this so purple? Like you see, or may maybe it's Bornite? Maybe it's Bornite, man. That would be huge. Check, check, check all these, um, Ingrid. So, so much more density in that alteration. <laughs> There's more stuff in this hole than the other hole. You and Jonathan were like, I don't know, man. I've never seen someone get so excited over rocks. What was it a good result? <laughs> <laughs> man, it was great. Like the second hole, I think, is better than the first one. And we got really wide alteration zones, the widest we've ever seen. We got some copper mineralization in addition to molybdenum mineralization. Look, we planted this hole 500 meters away, which is a quite a big distance away from the discovery hole, and it's actually better. It's better than the discovery hole. So we're planning a third hole now, which is really bold. The third hole is a whopping kilometer away from the second hole, and a whole kilometer and a half away from the discovery hole. So we are really excited and looking forward to update you about where this is gonna go.